So what's so special about this video that I'm responding to? Absolutely nothing. It's the same bullshit as usual. I'm just making this video to pass the time. Hello, Internet. My name is Eduardo Edwards, and today I want to talk about something really important. Yes, please spread the word of feminist Christ. Let's talk about feminism. So why do I want to talk about this topic today? A lot of people in my school are not feminists, and I find that very, very wrong. It's wrong that not many people are feminist? Yeah, holy fucking shit! Ever, you know, stop and think and wonder why people don't want to consider themselves feminists? Um, outside of the simple, they just don't know what feminism is argument? And I'll tell you why. By definition, feminism means... A big fucking pile of shit. The advocacy of women's rights on the ground of the equality of the sexes. In other words, a big pile of shit. And the last part is the most important one, equality of the sexes. Yep. Which is pretty much a big freaking joke right there. You know, bravo, bravo. I believe that it doesn't matter what sex you are, but you should get equal chances and opportunities to do something as if you're the other gender. Dude, you're elaborating so freaking poorly. Just say that that men and women should be freaking equal. Not this complicated crap that only children can understand. But with all seriousness, let me ask you a legitimate question. Do you really have to be a freaking feminist in order to believe in equality? Because I believe in all that shit and I'm not even a feminist. I'm an anti-feminist. I oppose almost everything that the feminists have said and brought up every freaking time. Why is our society so scared of feminism? Because you don't advocate what you believe in. I'm sure that you're an intelligent fella. You know, the argument that I'm presenting is the paraxis versus theory argument. And if you don't know what it is, look it up. Feminists present such shitty arguments that it's no fucking wonder why people avoid feminism. And the ones that do advocate for feminism, it's... They're just total fucking nut jobs. The only very f there are very few good feminists out there. Very few. And one of them is Christina Hoff Summers. Because at least she knows that the arguments that the majority of feminists have brought up is complete and utter bullshit. Especially the wage gap argument. Fucking hate it. Let me tell you, not many people know what feminism actually means. No. And they believe it means something else, like hating on men or believing that women are superior to men. But that has a different term that's actually called feminazi. Or an extremist feminist. Which makes pretty much almost the entire feminist community. That's also wrong. I am a feminist and I believe that in order for us as a civilization to be looked at Nicely, we should give equal opportunities to girls and boys. And we actually do. You have not presented any evidence that that doesn't happen. And men and women, or just people who are in the middle, we should not tolerate stereotypes like cooking is for girls, you know, making the money is for boys, pink is a girl and color, blue is a boyish color. I HOLY F- Fuck is this wrong? I don't think we need these stereotypes in our society. Our society is full of stereotypes and it's so wrong. And I just wanted to make this video for you guys to realize that f being a feminist is actually not a bad thing. I would actually believe you is if, if it wasn't for the fact about the paraxis versus theory argument. Um, which is basically this in a nutshell. You don't practice what you believe in! It is very good. You're showing maturity and you're showing understanding of the other gender. Again, do you need to be a feminist in order to do that? So, one more time. DENY! SIT DOWN! 
I am the Atheist Gamer. Peace the game out. So now that I'm done with that video, uh, it's time for a few updates. Uh, number one, uh, I noticed that there's this troll on the internet. You know, a few trolls, which I met a few years back. One of them is Nams, the other one's Orbital, and I forgot the other one. But either, but either one, two, or even all three of these guys have decided to gang up, create multiple accounts to not only um, discredit me, to make fun of me, but also dislike my videos in like a massive drove. Like, seriously? You create multiple fucking accounts just to dislike my fucking videos? You have no fucking life! You're pathetic! You, you, you are such a pathetic fucking loser! At least what I'm trying to do is try to get, you know, some form of attention. At least I'm trying to get a life on YouTube. You, you're pathetic, stupid, and I bet your ass you couldn't debate me, or anyone in that matter, even if you tried. Another thing is, is that, uh, I'm going to be on vacation for at least four days, but I won't return until Monday. My, vac my vacation starts on Wednesday, for four days. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. But I won't be able to upload any videos until Monday. Sunday is where I usually take my days off. I don't do shit on Sundays. I might, you know, check in the comment sections, and that's it. But other than that, I can't do shit about it. It's on Monday that I, you know, check all the stuff in my email and all that shit. Because I really uh, am noticing that I am slowly getting more and more subscribers. Almost every day, I get one subscriber. And that's amazing, you know. It's better than getting no subscribers at all. So I'm slowly, slowly increasing my subs. Maybe by the end of this month, or maybe at the beginning of this year, I will have 200 subs, and then I have to uh, make another Let's Play video. I heard request for rate date. That's what it's called. Rate, 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 rate date. And I saw the game. And all I to say is <laughs> that game, that fucking game, rape date, is, you know, gonna piss off a lot of feminists. If I play this game, some feminists would be so freaking outraged that a game like this exists and it needs to be banned. It needs to be completely gone, washed away, removed from existence. <laughs> oh. So you know what? As soon as I'm done playing um, five, five Nights at... Uh, Treasure Island, the demo, I might, if I get 200 subs, then I'll play that game. And if I continue getting, you know, more and more subs, I'll play more fucking video games. <laughs> but holy shit, rape date? It's fucking... I mean... I... Didn't even know a game like that even exists. <sighs> ah. So get me those 200 subs and I'll play the game. Uh, let's see, what else? Hmm. I'm going to start um, creating my Patreon account, make a Facebook page. I know, I know, I've been saying I've been making a Facebook page, but I don't even sure how many people even use Facebook. Uh, it's all about Twitter now. Uh, Facebook. Um, I'm going to try to make an Instagram. Um, and one of my other videos that's been removed immediately from YouTube, I'm going to try to re-upload again. Either on Vimo or some other website. Because 
it was removed quickly because of copyright issues. And I didn't want to, you know, have any trouble with YouTube. It's already... I, I, I've reached the point that I worked so freaking hard of getting all these subscribers, all these viewers, all this all these support. I'm not going to just toss it all away just for the sake of one fucking video. So, let's just hope. Let's just pray to God that uh, they, they, that my video can be seen. I, you know, it's, it's not even that great. It's, it's nothing too special. It's nothing, like, over-the-top amazing. It's just a simple video response, you know, of funny or die being fucking stupid. So that is all I have to say for now. Like I said before, I'm the Atheist Gamer. Peace.